Hello everyone, hope you guys are doing great. Myself Sheikh Fidhas. Today I am going to make a bath bombs. So let's see which ingredient we are going to require for making the bath bombs. So here I have one cup of the baking soda that is sodium bicarbonate and I have a half, half cup of citric acid and I have the organic coconut oil for moisturizing and here I have the Epsom salt. It's contained a magnesium sulfate. When magnesium sulfate dissolves in our body, it relaxes our muscles and reduces acne and much more. And here I have some gel colors. For decoration, I have bleachers, body safe bleachers, I have some petals, cupcake liners for shape and here I have the essential oils. This one is eucalyptus, lavender, tea tree and peppermint. To mix a 1 cup of a sodium bicarbonate and half cup of a citric acid into this bowl, we need 2 is to 1 ratio. I have mixed this both mixture. Now I am going to add the Epsom salt, 1 TBSP, half tablespoon of coconut oil. Now we'll mix this. I'm going to divide this mixture into the four different small bowls because I have a four different essential oil and four gel colors. I divided the mixture into the four bowls. Now I'm going to add the color and essential oil simultaneously. This is a red color. Red to pink. This is a lavender essential oil. 4 to 5 drops. This is peppermint oil. It's orange color. Eucalyptus oil. This is blue color. Tree tree oil. Now I'm going to mix this all. I'm done with mixing the, all the colors and the essential oil. Now I'm going to decorate a little bit to our bath bombs with some glitters and some petals. I sprinkle some glitter a little bit into the cup liners. Now I'm going to coat this little by little and we're going to press it for forming the shape. You can see the frizziness of the bath bombs. What happened? When a bath bomb comes in contact with water, the baking soda and the citric acid react to make a carbon dioxide bubbles. This is an acid based reaction where the sodium bicarbonate is a weak base and citric acid is a weak acid.